Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel Sagittarius I hope you are doing well I hope you are fine and safe and doing good Sagittarius This reading for today, this is for you Let us see what is coming towards you Sagittarius What is the guided message that is meant for you to know And ready for you to know This is for the Sagittarius sign let's look into your next 24 hours reading or daily collective reading I'm channeling the end of um, end of June towards the full month of July what is the message for the Sagittarius sign please let's look at your situation let's look at your focus Sagittarius and let's see what is your guided message okay you have the m sorry you have the queen of cups you have the knight of cups in here you have the libra card okay the four of cups the six of pentacles the knight of swords okay let's see what's coming towards you the queen of pentacles in here the eight and the hangman in well it's in reverse but I feel like it's for an upright position and, and so we start your reading um, you're starting the reading Sagittarius with the Queen of Cups excuse me guys <coughs> excuse me oh gosh sorry so you're starting the reading with the Queen of Cups you could be dealing with um, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy in here. You have the Knight of Cups. You have the Libra card. You know the Queen of Cups is very powerful as I look at it and you know sink into its um, energy. Um, you could be feel in terms of you know overall energy checked in Sagittarius, the the, the the Queen of Cups and the Knight of Cups in here you could be feeling like you're reflecting on the past version of yourself you know um, it's very powerful it's an I something okay um, something is going to somebody someone or something is going to trigger you Sagittarius to reflect on the past version of yourself and who you used to be or how like you're reflecting upon your version of yourself right now and the past version of yourself and somehow you are looking into this is who used to be I am when it comes to social dating work because something someone somebody a situation will trigger you to feel um a bit not like a bit nostalgic for what you once view life like okay you know in the past this is how i viewed my life okay like there's a there's a feeling of feeling nostalgic and how you view your life in the past my life is more simpler right now it's complicated why it's complicated because I want a lot of things you know um, my life is challenging or complicated but exciting because I want a lot of things I want a house I want a car I want a lover and because I want all of those things I should be willing to go through some challenges in the past my life is more simple because I probably just want a simple things in life so you could be in that moment of comparison Sagittarius you know um, there's something somebody it could be there was a decision that you made and you're reflecting upon your decision and that decision is connected to a past version of yourself or it could be somebody someone from the past comes along and you don't feel the same way all right so the next three seven ten days allow yourself to really understand why give yourself okay just this card give yourself time and the emotional and the mental 
and the intuitive awareness on why do you feel nostalgic why do you kind of need to feel again the, the the previous version of yourself and compare it to now because there is some sort of lesson learned or there's something that there's a takeaway that you would get from that so look into it it's it's a good reflection it's a reflection of okay this is where I am right now and who I am right now I feel like right now it's much simpler for some of you for some of you guys right now I'm a little bit in a um, maybe challenging situation or life could be a bit challenging maybe because you want a lot of things because you know sometimes when we do want this and this and that we have to put work and if we put work it will consume time energy money and it does give you some you know roadblock so you will view life simple like you would have a comparison that okay my life is simpler now or my life is simpler in the past because you would know that and you would know okay my life is complicated because okay so there is this very I would say a balance like the past is catching up with your present okay like the past version of yourself Sagittarius is catching up with the usual the now version of yourself and it looks like the past and the present the current version it's wanting to uh, ask permission to connect compare conceptualize and eventually you will tap into I'm really evolving you know and there's some part of you that you also realize Sagittarius that you have outgrown and there's some part of you that you miss this part of yourself and you would like to use it now so there is a lot of learnings feeling nostalgic and connecting the press the present and then you'll figure out which is the future version of yourself so it's good it's a good reflection Sagittarius maybe someone somebody maybe a news an information will trigger you to feel nostalgic to feel like going to memory lane look into the past version of how you were making decision how you're navigating life how simple it is and then comparing it to now what is the difference what is present what is not present okay look into that yes something shocking okay something or someone is going to trigger you to reflect Sagittarius I feel like it's a healthy reflection Sagittarius like an information a person a situation will happen and it will it feels like you're going to take a break and feel it and understand it okay all right now so the second part of the reading let's see what is coming towards you Sagittarius you have a four of cups I feel like there is unexpected offer Sagittarius but it's not big okay uh, the Knight of Swords let's see the Ace of Pentacles the Hermit card it could be a Virgo it could be a Capricorn it could be a Taurus um, the Four of Cups the Eight of Pentacles you know there's something connected to money okay there is a sec there is um, there's a situation connected to money there's a situation connected to connected to money connected to attention connected to relationship in here uh, the knight of swords they're coming they're coming in past okay like I don't know I think you know this person you know the situation they want to buy past like um like something tells me you've dealt with them and there was a delay and now they're back and they want you to hurry up with your decision making it could be connected to work it could be connected to love it could be connected to someone in the past but the thing with this person who is in a hurry they're in a hurry you're different now that's probably why I'm picking up the version of yourself in here because they're back you know like it's a there's there's work there is a sense of familiarity you're familiar with them you know with the eight of pentacles in he here you're familiar with them you know them they're familiar with you there's a sense of um, it's me again 
I've found you again. I'm back. So this Knight of Swords, this is what's coming towards you in the next 3, 7, 10 days. And they're opening up their feelings and their intention. And their mission, Sagittarius, is, is to speak the truth. Like this person, I think they will defend themselves on why they couldn't offer, they couldn't do it, they couldn't be there, they couldn't be your person. The Knight of Swords, they're in a hurry to connect with you and open up their feelings and also to get your respond and your reply. They want to speak the truth, Sagittarius, and also allow you to share your feelings too like somehow they would like because eight of pentacles eight of pentacles in here and there's look at that oh sorry this is six this is six eight and eight because there's a hangman it means that their full offer and this this whole thing you know i'm getting like this whole thing it won't work if you block them or you won't accept them they feel restless I don't know maybe this person is traveling and then they will see you or it could be suddenly something happened at work and there's a vacant position or there's a new structure or there's a new rule and you are enabled okay because it could be it could be career it could be money it could also be if it's not a work situation ship it's a personal situation ship but something is enable like something is enable enable you're now enable mm -hmm. like you can have it now they were able to enable the situation like somehow this person they work they work hard to make it happen for you and for them now there is a million dollar question like uh, there's a burning question with this person Sagittarius because do you want it back do you want to connect do you want to accept it and the thing is they want your answer as soon as possible eight of pentacles in here and somehow you're like mm -hmm, am I still interested with the position am I inst still interested with this person because this is you you have the information you have the message you have the email you have the pentacle but you're not signing in you're not you're not yes yeah, signing you're not signing the contract you're not responding you're not replying hmm. there, there's something you know there's something valuable about what they offer like they're still valuable you're still you're still very much interested but there's a part of you that it has changed and it might not it might not be as interested to whatever they're offering let's see you know what this person or situation Sagittarius it's still a great offer but there is like there's a feeling of I don't want to go through the same three of swords it, it's like um, if you accept it you might experience the three of swords again and you don't want to experience that so it might take some time for you to reply respond confirm because you care about your time you care about your money you care about your energy you don't want to go through the same you know three of swords because this is what you fear it's still great it's valuable you know it's giving me this feeling that um it's giving me this feeling that wow this is still a great job a great offer good pay very very good pay but stressful and i think in the past you are somehow or it's challenging and i think in the past it's like i'm in for a challenge you want the money and I'm in for the challenge but right now they're offering to you good pay but there's a tree of swords and you might not you might be at a point where I want to be peaceful and practical like money is good but it's not if it's too 
complicated, I might just say no. So it's going to be up to you, Sagittarius, but there is a hesitation. You have a hesitation. You have a big of a hesitation. Look into it. Okay, look into it. You might want to speak to them to guarantee about this three of swords. Okay, there's something that you're hesitating. There's a big haste like it's a it's a it's a good offer, but there is also a big red flag. And before you you make a final decision, look into it. How can you negotiate it or how can you ensure that it doesn't happen? Because it could just be one sided. It could just be you're not super confident with them because they might give you a three of swords. What if they're confident and can guarantee you that they won't give you this? So look into look into it. Look everything into it. Okay? Remember, it could be the reason why I'm picking up this vibe, Sagittarius, where maybe the past version of yourself would just reject it. Maybe right now, the present version of yourself would listen, would look, would explore before you make a final decision. So, thank you so much, Sagittarius, for connecting with me. Thank you so much, Sagittarius, for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Sagittarius, click the bell, click subscribe, and I'll see you soon again, guys. You have a great day. Bye, Sagittarius.